Hello everyone, welcome to our segment on Real Talk, where we talk about real situations that happen to real people that can sometimes be real uncomfortable. I think enough time has passed that we can finally bring up the winter storm of February 21, aka Snowvid, aka Snowpocalypse, basically where Texas just shut down for an entire week, mainly because our power grid wasn't working well and the roads were blanketed with snow, and here in Texas, we don't get that often. I think a lot of people learned a lot of hard lessons um, with that storm, what to do, what not to do. And um, the reason I bring this up is because the Farmer's Almanac, which predicted the February storm, is also predicting that there's going to be another storm in late January of 2022. So what I would encourage everyone to do is to make a plan to be able to get out of your house if one of your pipes freeze, you know, call up a friend who has a four by four truck, which here in Texas isn't hard to find, um, and make sure that they're willing to come get you if you really need to at the end of the day. Maybe stock up on a little water, um, you know, do and talk about to your plumber about possibly shutting the water off and what is in, what all entails to do so and making sure to get the water out of your pipes. Um, there's a lot of things you can do to protect your property, but at the end of the day, what you need to do is protect yourself. Maybe think about getting a portable heater if God forbid the electricity goes out again. Um, just definitely want to prepare ahead of time because as we know, when the snowstorm hit last year, or earlier this year, excuse me, um, the shelves were empty of everything. Stores were out of milk, eggs, um, you know, there was no propane gas to be found anywhere. So take the time now to prepare yourself and to make sure that you and your family are safe when and if it happens again. That's all I have for today. Thank you for coming to our Real Talk segment. We'll see you next time.